Al Cadullo, the 3D guy at SeaTech in Japan. And we have with us the chief engineer on the amazing new Sony high, high frame rate, single lens, 3D camera. Tell us a little bit about the idea that, that was brought to, to bear when you created this camera. Oh yeah, our target is a natural and smooth motion image. So at first we are developing a high frame rate camera and we uh, thought uh, we need um, 3D impression. So then we developed a 3D optical system. That's a story, simple story. Okay, now with, with 3D, normally you have an interocular distance that's equal to the spacing, at least the spacing of the eye. What have you done a little bit differently with this system in order to create this? Uh, yeah, uh, in order to get the baseline, uh, we are used to um, single single lens. Therefore, that basic um, uh, baseline is about 20 millimeters. But uh, I think 20 millimeter will be enough. Because we are using a zooming something, and our sensitivity of the disparity is very high, so uh, I think it's enough. Well, having seen the image, it, it's a beautiful image, and you do feel like you're looking into a window into the, into the scene. Um, this is a rather large camera. This isn't something that the consumer would definitely be seeing anytime soon. Uh, yeah, uh, so at first uh, we are uh, developing for a business uh, kind of uh, professional um, camera, but uh, in the future we will study uh, to introduce this idea to the consumer electronics. So a miniaturized version is on the board somewhere down the line. Uh, yeah, so we will we'll make our, our effort. Do you believe that this is going to be another fad? Or do you think that this is something that's going to last a long time, that everybody's going to have this eventually? Um, this is probably three, third time uh, 3D boom. And uh, the technology is uh, completely different uh, than before. So I think uh, this 3D boom will be continued. Very good. There you have it, an exclusive report from Sony at SeaTech.